Hi, this is Ryan, and here we'll be demonstrating the completed anchorless prototype. This was the first test we were able to do this year on the water. Here we perform basic forward and backward movement by sending commands over SSH. Later, we were able to test in a larger body of water at Lake Los Carneros. Here we could demonstrate turning and have it navigate farther distances on its own. Here, the rudder is automatically positioning itself to redirect the boat towards a particular compass direction. It's using the data from the CMPS-12 inside the box to determine which way to turn. There, you just heard the thruster turning on and calibrating. It is left at a low power state until the thruster is needed to conserve energy. Once calibrated, the thruster turns on, and the boat moves forward until it is within the range of the target GPS location. We're keeping the boat tethered for these tests because the automatic driving is much harder to control in small areas such as this because of the delay on cellular commands and the accuracy of the GPS. Our implementation works best on larger, more open bodies of water. We are, however, able to manually drive it over SSH to demonstrate the boat's turning ability and maneuverability. As you can see, the boat moves fairly quickly on the water. This, however, is actually still a very low speed for this thruster. If needed, it could be set to run about three times as fast as this. We just have it set to this speed because this is what we determined was necessary for this particular project. We were able to drive to the left or right with ease and the automatic system does the same thing to drive towards the set location. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching.